we should address safety matters. Must always wear gloves. A mask when necessary. Clear ventilation into the room. And always have a bare flame near a petrol tank. That's the safety message. Okay. Here is another day of taking apart the engine. This will be the new head gasket. This one is the new one. This is the old one. In the bin. I've ordered another one of these. Got a new fuel filter. I've got new uh, head um, stretch bolts or whatever you call them. The new rocker cover gasket and the uh, inner one. Don't know what that is for yet. I've given this a good clean. Check that out. Nice and clean. Given the fuel injectors a nice little clean up. And I've got new O-rings and rubbers for for these. Got a new uh, throttle cable. And this one is not frayed. So let's continue. I want to get the exhaust off and the cam belt cover. If I could get this cam belt cover off to take a look, I'd be a happy man. And this exhaust. And also get this off if I can. Okay, let's take these bolts out. I've got some new sockets here, longer deep sockets you call them. Deep sockets makes my life a trillion times easier. Pretty loose that one. This one was weird. This came out from the actual um, stud. Look how seized up and shit that is. That was six exhaust bolts all together but one came out on the stud all 14 mil I can't get that off I'm wiggling it <sighs> need to get some sort of crowbar I don't know how to pry this off rubber mallet car up to get to the uh, get to the exhaust and it's lovely and dirty oh. brush some of this off I think that thing is the what do you call it the lambda sensor or something it looks pretty new to me so I'm wondering if that's been changed this is the bottom of the exhaust. Looks like it's been off before. Okay, so underneath the car, I cracked the bolt off of this. It's a heat shield or something. I oh, got that. Now the bolt here, I cracked it off. There was no bolt here. <laughs> 